So trophy earned the spirits. Chapter 6, Time Well Spent, Little Italy, February 26th, 1945. Vito Scaletta? Yeah? What's it to you? You're under arrest for the illegal distribution of federal ration stamps. You're coming with us. One of the gas station attendants ratted me out. The guy fingered me and they strung our mama into telling him where I was staying. But they had no idea who I was working for and I wasn't about to tell them. Henry was able to get me a lawyer, courtesy of his boss, Clementi. I was up Shit's Creek, but at least I had a battle. Could have been a hell of a lot worse if the feds knew and about I any of my other activities. And I find to be even more serious, considering the fact that you stole national resources at a time when our country needs them the most. And that's the gravity of which you, Mr. Scaletta... The guy was good, but even he couldn't get me out of this one. It was a lost cause from day one. Three months later, they handed down the verdict. Vittorio Antonio Scaletta, for your crimes against the people of this city and of this great country, this court hereby sentences you to 10 years in a federal penitentiary. Damn. 10 years, that's a decade, man. The federal pen. Thieves, murderers, child molesters, they're all here. The worst of the worst. All right, get in line, gentlemen. Follow me, single file. And no monkey business, or else. Stop right there. Turn to your right. Your other right. Listen up, assholes. My name is Captain Terrence Stone, and this is my prison. You're here on the inside because you can't behave like normal human beings on the outside. Make no mistake. Your ass belongs to me now, and you'll do what I say, or you'll be sorry that you did it! Fuck with me, and I'll fuck with your sorry ass all day long! You were sent here to be rehabilitated, and rehabilitate you? We will. Okay, you assholes. We're gonna cut you loose, 
just long enough to get you cleaned up. Now get in line and follow me. Damn. تعامل من الزبالة يا رجل. Welcome to the salon, ladies. You're gonna look just fucking beautiful. Hey, me too. I ain't got nothing on my head to cut. Shut your face, cue ball. I'm calm so with the people, would ya? Okay, let's go. Hey, shit for brains. Do what you fucking told. May the gods proceed down the stairs. Down the wall? Ah. Down the corridor. Okay. We're going to have to check the main menu. You ain't going to do what you told me. We're going to stick you in the hole. Follow me. عمل بيكون زفت في نجات قادم توقع بريزن بريك ياه ممكن سمو يو نو فيش ممكن هون جد ان ايه زبالة الزبالة لايتس اوف ان بي It's a bed in your cell. Okay. Don't know now. We're in the cell. I go off your head, BJ. This is gonna be my new home for the next ten years. Look like shit and smell like piss. I would have preferred dodging bullets in Europe to this. Me too. Three days later. إلا ما قابل واحد في الكافيتيريا. After three action-packed days of staring at the wall, I got a message from Joe to contact a guy named Leo Galante, who could supposedly help me out here. This wasn't the kind of place where you could survive on your own. حقيقي. حقيقي. Okay, contract Leo. When is Leo? Uh, hey, uh, I'm looking for uh, Leo Galante. You know where I can find him? I got nothing to say to you. Arshik, طيب عطيك. Excuse me, you know where Leo Galante is? Sorry, I can't help you out. Excuse me, you know where Leo Galante is? Hey, man, make your ass like a tree and get the fuck out of my face. Get out of the city and beat. Uh, hey, um. I'm looking for uh, Leo Galante. Oh, you know, seen game lately? You best quit bugging me if He's you know what's good for you. Again? Holy yep. shit. <laughs> to us. I'm looking for Leo Galante. Leave me the fuck alone. No one is helping me. I'm looking for Leo Galante. Sorry, no English. Okay. I know you. You know me. You're that fucking guinea who was with Bobber in the jewelry store. I'm in this fucking hell hell because of you. You got locked up because you're a stupid, crazy fuck. And he sent you here, you guinea bastard. So that I could pay you back. This looks interesting. Want to make a small bet? Come on, you overgrown retard! You and your boyfriend, Baka. Not electric. This is gonna be easier than the time I shoved a potato up your mother's ass. It's like you for breakfast. Kill him, O'Neal. Kick his ass, O'Neal. Shit. Fucking brain. Step back. Did you hear me? Get out of here. Move it. Sold. 
Okay, shit. You do something about it. We're gonna give you a little time to think about what you've done. Damn. Close it up. So O'Neill almost took my head off, but I made a stand. Let me tell you something, when you're inside, it counts for a lot more than you might think. Hey, well, I get, I get two days later. How long are you planning on keeping him in here? Long enough to learn his lesson. That's gonna have to change. He in any shape to fight. Should be. Boys didn't knock him around too bad after the brawl in the yard. All right, open it up. Rise and shine, Skeletta. You got yourself a visitor. Leo. My name is Leo Galante. I heard you wanted to speak to me. Yeah. Uh, one of Clemente's guys said I should contact you. Said maybe you could help me out. Oh, fuck Clemente. I don't provide protection for his guys in here. But I saw how you handled that Mick who's after you, O'Neill. You could prove useful. Come with me, boy. <clears throat> now listen up, fellas. This is Vito. He's gonna be helping us out. Peppy here's got a big fight coming up against O'Neill. He needs a sparring partner. From what I saw of you out there in the yard, you're just the man for the job. You're gonna help us out, kid. In return, you'll be under my protection. And who knows? Maybe you'll even learn a thing or two along the way. I guess I can't say no to that offer, huh? I don't remember asking. All right, fellas. Let's get this show on the road. Mm. Okay. So Today we're gonna work on your counterpunching. Vito, I want you to hit Pepe. Try and bust that big jaw of his. Pepe, you avoid the punch like I showed you. Then use that momentum to throw a punch of your own. All right, fellas. Let's get going. Yeah. Come on, coward. Come on now. Fight like a man. What, are you tired oh, already, kid? Enjoy this. Come on. Atta boy, Pepe. Keep that oversized chin of yours down, damn it. Footwork, Peppy. Remember your footwork. Ah! Remember, good defense can win a fight, fellas. Every punch you take oh, could be your good. last. Whoa! Would you look at that? Hey! We supposed to be sparring or training? Change of plans, big fella. This kid's got fire in him. So now you're both gonna practice your counter punches. All right, Vito. <laughs> See if you can do that again. It's a handy tool to have in a box, huh? And most guys ain't gonna see it coming. Peppy here, <laughs> he ain't most guys, though. Nice one. <clears throat> Shit, that had a hurt. <clears throat> oh! <clears throat> Ouch. Nice, kid, nice. Give me two more Bang. of those. <laughs> All right, one more. Nice view. one. Ah, there you go. You're a fast learner, kid. All right, fellas, that's enough for today. Nice work. So how close did you get to Clemente, Vito? Actually, I never met him. I always dealt with either Henry Tomasino or Luca Garino. Huh. I can't believe that cocksucker Garino's still breathing. What was your deal with him? Well, you know, we did a couple jobs for him, and, uh... Luca said he'd bring us into the family for, uh, five grand. What? Typical fucking Alberto. He's always been a crooked bastard. Uh, so what is that, like, more than usual? Yeah, like five grand more than usual. You don't gotta pay to get in, Vito. You're brought into the family once you prove that you're loyal, a good earner. And he can handle... <laughs> you know, the life. In any case, this is an interesting piece of news. When this gets out, Alberto and Luca are gonna have a lot of explaining to do. To who? Jeez. Don't worry about that. We'll talk about it some other time. Hey, get to know the other guys or leave the gym. I think I'm gonna leave the gym.
Watch where you walk, Guaylo. Well, maybe if your eyes were all the way open, you would have seen me coming, asshole. Galante. Crooked white devil. Nice to see you too, <laughs> Mr. Wu. Crooked? You bet on your own guy and he lost. That's the way it works in this country. Then Wu offer you a rematch. I think I can arrange that. You up to it, Vito? Chinaman, huh? Yeah, get him a stepladder and send him over. All right, Wu. Looks like you got yourself a rematch. And none of that chop suey crap this time. Now listen, these chinks are quick little bastards. No point in throwing big punches early on. You'll never connect. All right. What am I supposed to do then? You hit him quick and tire him out. When he's weak, he'll put his guard down. Then you swing for the fences. Now get out there and show him what you're made of. I think I'm gonna lose. Hey, you'll get a fortune cookie after eating your guy for breakfast. <laughs> Show me what you got, show me what you got. His master will not be happy. There's no happen if you use tiger style. Okay, one week later. Settle it and so take a Let's go, Scaletta. You're late for work. Okay, follow the gods. I think I'll get out of here. That's the jelly, but yeah, maybe. Who knows? Hey, listen. Vito here's got the day off, courtesy of Mr. Galante. Gotcha. Don't get used to it, Scaletta. All right. Come with me, Vito. What, are we gonna train some more? Uh, sorta. You'll see. I go on Faga. A prison break. Morning, kid. Morning, Mr. Galante. Why no training today? Not exactly. We got a challenge from the spooks, and I don't want to risk Peppy getting all banged up before his big fight with O'Neill. So I want you to take this one. It'll be good practice for you. Come on. Okay. Into the laundry room and prepare for a fight. The guy you're going to be fighting is a strong bastard, but he ain't too bright. Fights with his heart, not his head. You piss him off, you lower his guard. That's when you let him have it. All right, here we go. Make me proud, kid. Ooh, looky here. I'ma take this skinny ass white boy to school. Gonna <laughs> hit him so hard his day. mama's mama gonna feel it. Come get me. Balls getting ready to lose. <laughs> hey, win or lose, it'll probably be the hardest work this bum ever did in his life. <laughs> Your little cracker going down. <laughs> Let's go, Vito. Put these bums back in their place. <laughs> oh, this boy got as much chance of winning as a brother running for president. 
Oh, Damn. come on, my grandmama hit me hotter than that. Don't worry, Nito, you got him right where you want him. Oh, no, Nito, grab him and finish him off. Now's your chance, kid. Knock him in the next one. Oh, no Damn, he's dead. Hell of a job, kid. Hell of a job. Here's your cut, Vito. You earned it. Yo, one of the hacks is coming. Oh, shit. What the hell is this? Some kind of circle jerk? All right, come on, Scaletta. You got a vid. Okay. Hi, Vito. Hey, Frankie. Visit from my sister. How you doing? I'm doing good. Real good, thanks. So, uh, how's things? Well, I, I got something to tell you. I'm getting married, Vito. Oh, Maron, that's great. I mean, it would have been nice if he asked my permission first, but hey, I'm happy for you. Vito, you're in jail. Look at yourself. Uh, how'd you let this happen? Hey, I already got a lecture from the judge, huh? I shall need another one. Just, just drop it, all right? Vito. There's something else. It's Mama. What do you mean? What about her? She's sick, Vito. She's been like this for weeks, and she's not getting any better. Look, Frankie. Go to Joe's. He's holding on to my money for me. You get her the best doctor you can find. And, uh... You keep the rest as a wedding gift. Vito... No, no, I mean it. Looks like I'm not gonna need it for a while. All right, looks like I gotta go. Uh, look, you take care of Ma. Tell her I love her. I will. And thanks, Vito. Bye. Full family. I hate this. Okay, one week later. Let's go, Scaletta. Those turlets ain't gonna clean themselves. So, the Asker is the Vizine, but the do a civil fire scene. Okay, follow the guard. I hate the bathroom. I hate it. So, you're the new cleaning lady, huh? Follow me. Hey, pal. You mind? Yo, practice that shit somewhere. Well, at least they not make it. Come on, man, you're yelling at me. Jesus, you're singing. It's the second worst thing that happened to me in here. There you go. Hey, make them spawn. Oh, hurry it up. Get the tool dirty. Urinals? Okay. Death? That's more like it. Oh, I Clean it good. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. I'll try to help you, Kalem, my friend. Holy shit. Oh, my God. I'm not going to get out of here. I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to get out of here. What's the matter? Keep cleaning, or else. Hey, looks like this one's still dirty. Clean it again. Ya Allah. يا الله على الريحة قسم بالله الريحة وصلتني أنا هي <تصفيق> شكل خوي بزغل في الثاني بيقول لي يلا نظف من جديد <تصفيق> لا عارف <من> المدلة <تصفيق> All right that's enough now you're gonna go join the rest of the animals in the showers <تصفيق> 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 
All right, Scaletta, get your clothes off and get cleaned up, would you kindly? My God, I hate this. Ah, he know what in. Yo. Okay. كده مويه بس بدون لا صابون ولا شامبو ولا شيء يعني. Hey, Frankie, we got a little business to take care of here, huh? Why don't you go out of the way? Yeah, sure. Have your fun, you sick bastards. Shit. My god, I hate this. Yes! I like your scars, pretty boy. Where'd you get them? Well, let me some figure. Sorry, asshole. You picked the wrong ass to drill. We can do this the easy <laughs> way or the hard way. Oh, dirty no prison choice. talk. I got a better idea. <laughs> Why don't you go fuck your buddies instead? Or better yet, go fuck yourself. <laughs> okay. Oh, I I so <laughs> رافة الله يعلمك الرافة الحين تعال الله دب الله دب ما عندي ما عندي جدي دب يا رجال الله يلعنه دو ذات اجين سويت دو ذات اجين دايرة 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 ايه انا لك دي سو موشن who's next تعال 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 ابغاك يلا قم 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 هاي هاي انت عارف ايش كان يصير يا يا الوسخ دون بوي يو نو ذا دريل او اند this came today. Might want to read it. Looks important. No, 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 no! Come on, Matt, it's... Mama died while Francesca was visiting me. I knew it. Instead of going toward a good doctor and a wedding gift, every penny I had went to the funeral. I said when I began, I'm not to move. Can I get a sense? If I'm not good, I'm from the mud. He killed the cat. Mr. Galante wants to talk to you. Come with me. Good to have you back, kid. What the hell happened? Looks like the mix weren't up for a fair fight. A couple of them jumped Pepe yesterday. It was a lot more than a couple. Yeah, well, we sure as hell ain't gonna let this go. What do you got in mind? Pepe's got it all worked out. Took a little persuading, but O'Neill's all by himself right now in the gym. Guards won't be back for a while. You're just gonna give him a good beating, break a couple of bones, same as they did to me. Got it? Yeah, I got it. All right, come with me. Break a leg, kid. I'll wait out here. If the guards get back early, I'll warn you. Okay. All right, go for it. Hey, O'Neal. I got a little business to settle with you. Just the man I wanted to see. Allah, this is what I want. Come here, Mary. 
Holy shit. I don't know. Okay. Nice shot, Mary. No guards to see you this time. <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, me ma used to hit harder than that. Come on, you little baby. Is that all you've got? Dad, dad, dad. Jesus, what the fuck are you made of? Oh, you'll have to do better than that, little girl. Damn. Try again, little man. This time I'll finish you. Get up, I'm not done with you. لا 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 ما اتفقنا على كذا ما معي ماكو ولا شيء كم اون ايوه شات ذا فاك اب حلو كذا حبيبي يلا شد حيلك انت ما تبغى عسكر المره هذه ها سو تروفي تايم ويل سبنت they never found out who did it Leo arranged for me to relocate to his cell well, actually it was more like a suite life was getting better by the minute so Vito what do you plan on doing when you get out of this shit hole i don't know I sure as hell ain't gonna go back to work on Fla Clemente, I can tell you that. Yeah, you're better off just forgetting about that old bastard. Trust me, Alberto's a real cocksucker. And you can bet that lawyer he's hired was just there to make sure you didn't rot. <laughs> but don't worry. You'll get his. Letting guys into your family for money like he offered you is against the rules. He's gonna have a lot of explaining to do. To who? I thought Clemente was the boss. You obviously don't know how things work around here. You see, there's more than one family in Empire Bay. There's three. Each family controls their own neighborhoods. There's a system of rules. And if there's any disagreements, the bosses of all the families meet to work things out. That's the commission. Great, so what do I do now? Am I in trouble too? No, 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 no. nothing like that. You're young, you're smart, and you've proven you can keep your mouth shut. You're exactly the type of guy everybody wants working for him. Yeah, but I don't even know who these other guys are. There's two other bosses besides Clemente. One is Carlo Falcone. The other is Frank Vinci. Carlo is young and ambitious. The guy's a freaking nut job. He's new blood. Whereas Don Vinci is a man of honor. He respects the old ways. You know these guys? <laughs> you could say that. And Frank Vinci is consigliere. You think being just a regular old man gets you all this? But listen, Vito, I'm getting out in a few months. When I do, you'll see what we can do about adjusting your sentence. Pepe, come here. Have a taste.